what is the, the, the current thought of, like you said, in the case of your husband on statin drugs, to lower cholesterol? What is, what is that doing to our overall health if we're trying to drive cholesterol to you know, very low numbers? Yeah, well, of course, it's going to cause even a worse problem with the cholesterol deficiency that you already face. Um, and cholesterol deficiency will lead to things like uh, Alzheimer's disease. Uh, statin drugs, in particular, are really uh, terrible. I, the, I have studied them very well, and I have collected thousands of papers on the adverse effects of statin drugs. One of the most recent papers that I just, uh, just came out, I really loved it because it explained um, very clearly how statin drugs make you grow older faster, because that's really the way I would describe statins. They, they, it's been, they've been shown to cause increased risk to cataracts, hearing loss, hair loss, arthritis, diabetes, um, gut disorder, you know, digestive problems. Um, you know, the list goes on and on. Mm -hmm. And um, there's even lung problems with fibrosis in the lungs. I mean, all kinds of strange things that are caused by statin drugs. And um, many of these things are, um, you could call aging, you mm -hmm. know. Sure. And uh, this paper showed specifically that statin drugs mess up these stem cells that come out of the bone marrow and are supposed to go in and replace cells that have died through aging. You know, so through the aging process, this, the cells in your heart, for example, can just get broken and mm -hmm. die. And these, me these mesenchymal stem cells go in and then they evolve into replacement cells. It's really beautiful. But statin drugs mess up that process. So that is huge because that's how you can explain the inability to maintain your, your organ function with, mm -hmm. as you age. Um, and it's also particularly a problem in the joints and in the, and in the bones because some of these mesenchymal stem cells are really important for renewing your bones. And we have a real problem th these days with uh, elderly people suffering from severe osteoporosis. Mm -hmm. I mean, you see so many people whose bones are very fragile. They'll have fractures, you know, really easily fractured mm -hmm. bones. Very, very um, poor health, poor bone health. And of course, also poor joint health, all this inflammation in the joints that, that people are suffering from, rheumatoid arthritis, all of these things are going to be aggravated by the statin drug.